Here's a demo of my working garage door opener project, uh, automated house. And as you'll see, the open hab is displaying an option for toggling the garage door button. And it gives me a visual status refresh option. It basically just uses the Raspberry Pi camera to take an updated version of the picture. And then below it is the last still image that was taken by the Raspberry Pi and stored on the Garage Door Opener Pi's uh, Apache web server interface. So as you'll see here, I have a Garage Door Opener and that gray cable, if you can see it running to the right, that is where I tie it in to contacts one and two of the Garage Door Opener to make that uh, temporary momentary trigger of um, basically shorting those two contacts together via the relay and this wire then runs around the top of the garage door I'm sorry the top of the garage and over to you on top of this bridge here which is again just set up as a temporary location you'll see the Raspberry Pi's uh, camera that's the no IR camera the low light camera and then behind it here we have the relay uh, attached to the Raspberry Pi. The green wire goes from pin 17, uh, which is uh, the GPIO general uh, pin zero uh, internally. And then you have the, or the red and the black going to VCC and ground relative. Uh, and basically the Raspberry Pi provides a five volt DC out and that's what that's connected to for the red going to the VCC on the relay. And then on the relay board we have, we're using the, it has both open and closed contact, uh, normally open, normally closed contact options. We're using the normally open for this purpose. And then here you'll see the blinking blue light. That is the Edimax Wi-Fi um, uh, module, USB module, that allows us to talk to our network. And then over here is just the Five volt DC standard uh, thing you can buy from Adafruit or any others. Okay, so that said, when when we trigger this, it's just refreshed all. I'm trying to see if I can get the button to show. There's the button. So press the toggle button. You see immediately the module open it opens. And my phone just buzzed and gave me the text SMS message saying that the garage door was triggered. Alright, so you see it did open. And then when I press it again, and if I if I refresh this screen, you see that. Okay, so it's, now I'm going to toggle it again. You see the door shuts. And also, once again, get notice that the garage door is triggered. And you see here that the pie is a little bit behind. It's having to refresh after the picture is taken. The picture takes a little while to take. Um, so you'll see my wife just drove up in the van and probably perturbed that I just shut the door on her. So I'll open it back up again. So that concludes my Raspberry Pi project. Thanks for viewing.